I have stressed in the conversation that we had that even though Italy faces some challenges, Italy is a fundamentally sound country. Italy's current account deficit and budget deficit are significantly smaller than those of many other countries. There is considerable net wealth in the private sector and the country is home to innovative and productive firms. And I'm confident by continuing the reform that the uh, current government has undertaken, Italy would not only overcome, will not only overcome the challenges, but only also exit uh, this current situation stronger than before. Of course, uh, uh, we also took stock that the economic situation worldwide is now more difficult. Uh, the uh, economy, uh, the global economy, have uh, a, a cyclical slowdown, and that, uh, of course, adds uh, to uh, the challenge uh, that we all have to face. And of course, uh, uh, Italy a challenge as well, um, because being in a period of uh, very deep restructuring, having to face the headwind of a non-favorable uh, economic world situation uh, is not simple. I have my question for you. Mr. Draghi said yesterday in Berlin, um, you can either take action or you can uh, say no to everything. Thank you. Thanks for your visit. Thank you.